welcome back to another day at the trailer. Guys, we are so close to finishing. It is so exciting. So I wasn't here last weekend when they were finishing putting in the shelves underneath the worktop. So I'm excited to see that. And then they also last week fitted, so the serving hatch, we wanted a um, so we've got the main worktop and then we wanted a shelf that folded out as well so they fitted that and put the chains on it and stuff and the hinges and whatnot so um, i've seen photos of it but i haven't seen it in real life so i'm really excited to see what they did last week This weekend will hopefully be famous last words the last weekend before we can start putting in all of our equipment and stuff so we do need to figure out plumbing which may take longer than we think and we need to varnish the worktops varnish the walls and then also the outside as well but it's a bit drizzly today so i'm not sure if we're going to be able to do that um, and then some other last little bits we need to finish painting the mud guards on the wheels and stuff like that but yeah let's go and see what they did last week. Okay, let's come and see. Ooh. Excuse me, please, I'd like a latte. Okay. Yes. Oh, yeah. nice. Yeah. That's all well good. Oh, wow, look at these. How good. The shelves. That's cool. So we've got the shelves. Okay, we're testing the plumbing. I'm going to put it down the little one first. Okay? Ready? Yeah. Filling up the tank for the first time so that we can check whether or not the water system works. Gary's connected everything. We had quite a bit of trouble figuring out how to connect this water pump to two sinks um, and then also finding the right adapter because the white cabling there is quite small. So it took quite a job trying to find the right thing. Um, but then we ended up buying these stoppers, taps, for the tanks yesterday for Wix and then today we realised that they were exactly what we needed for the water pump. So, in theory it's all connected, but in practice, we'll see if it works. It's quite a monumental occasion. How do you feel? How do you feel? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> This is quite a monumental occasion. So how do you feel? So what's that? The pump that's on now? Yeah. Oh sh! Oh sh! Oh sh! Turn it off! Turn it off! Oh sh! Well, that's leaking. Where's it coming from? Everywhere. Here we go again. Take two. Turn the plug on. On the plumbing. Oh sh! Oh, it's better. But it's just coming out of the top one. Oh, oh. We have water! Oh sh! Leaking out. Oh sh! 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 had some fiddling about with the taps and the sinks so we're gonna try and see if this black one works Ready? have we turned the pump on no probably not that'd help oh yes we have 
let's check this one. Right, that's about him. Okay, so this is just not at all. Okay, so we've got two sinks, one for hand washing, one for washing appliances and utensils. We've got an electric um, tap for the hot water, um, so that reaches across both sinks. Um, out of this one is just cold water, but we've got the hose mainly to be able to hose off um, like the blender and things like that. Um, so those are our sinks, and then we've got a 65 litre water tank. Um, we're not up and running yet, so I'll let you know when we are, whether or not that's a good size for your water tank. Um, and then under here, we've got our water pump. So this came with it, which connects to that, and then the water pump plugs in up there. Um, and then we've got two feeds. So we've got this that comes out of the water pump, um, and then that goes up there into the electric tap, and then that one joins there for the cold water tap. Um, Gary figured all that out. <laughs> Um, and then we've got our wastewater, so obviously wastewater for that sink, wastewater from that sink, and then it all joins up there, comes out through a hole in the floor, and then into our wastewater tank, which is outside, um, and that is the same size as that one, 65 litres. Um, so yeah, that is our sink setup. Um, obviously, I know you need hot water for washing up, which is why that spreads across the two. Um, and then we have also got an urn as well, so if we do need to top up the hot water in the sink, um, like in a bowl of washing up, then we can put hot water from there into there and cool it down with cold water. So, yeah, that's that.